There's a battery charger for car batteries. Ultimate speed car battery charger, 5 amps. Okay, it has a processor. It's good for 6 volts and 12 volt batteries also. Reverse polarity protection, short circuit protection and overload protection. It has 4 programs. Seven charge levels. So it's charging in impulses. So that's inside the box. It's pretty thick. It's in multiple languages. It has LEDs there, it has a button, it's a push button, these are nothing. Triangular screws. So this is pretty well protected, here at the ends you might touch it, and here. Ok, so let's see what will happen if I simply connect it to the battery. So minus there and plus there. There was a spark. Nothing on the display. Okay, now let's plug it in. It has a blue light. It says zero volts. Now let's connect the other one also. So zero volts. and 11.9 volts motorcycle sign car sign winter nothing one line just appeared there two 13.4 volts Now it's 12, 12.9. So let's see what does the multimeter say. The multimeter mentions 13 volts, 0 0.16 and there's 0 0.0. 13.0 down, 13.19 up. Okay, so let's try another thing. It says it has short circuit and reverse polarity protection. Reverse polarity, let's connect it in reverse. So that's the plus sign and here's the black. Let's see what will happen. Yes, we have a light. And it's not charging when there is the light. Okay, now let's try the short circuit protection. So I will touch these. Nothing. No LED, nothing on the LCD. Now let's see, is it still charging? There was an error, error sign, but now it's at 12 volts. There is no noise at all, it's totally silent. Let's see, 
now it's charging 13 so currently it's plugged in and charging it says 13.1 volts but if I remove it from the power and of course it stops let's say the power was interrupted now the power is restored and it is not charging automatically it's not at 13.1 it's at 12.5 and now it's 12.4 it's dropping so if power is interrupted this is not automatically charging the battery again you have to manually push that button and then it is charging it and now the battery is fully charged it says 12.8 volts and the side that line is not flashing so it's not charging It's not charging let's see if I remove it now everything disappeared from there if I connect it back now it's showing the voltage of the battery 12.7 and now it's charging so when the side that line is flashing then it's charging when it's not flashing then it's fully charged and when fully charged it should have four lines instead of three so Remove that one and now it's not showing us the programs. So the first three programs are for 12 volts. The bicycle it's also 12 volts. The car is also 12 and the snow is also 12. And only the fourth one which of course is not shown because the 12 volt battery is connected. The fourth one is only for 6 volts. The car sign is charging till 14.4 volts and the snow is charging a little bit higher, 14.7 volts I think. So for winter time you can get a higher charge, a higher voltage. While charging the back of the charger got a little bit warm, nothing serious, but later it's cooler. Now it's at 4 lines and the exterior is not flashing so it's not charging currently and it stopped at 13 volt <laughs> it's unplugged and only now it's stopped and when the battery is fully charged you should have a green light here currently it's not really showing you can place these caps back that's for the minus that's for the plus let's shake it a little bit now it's not visible but it says here that when it's green then it is charged when it's black then it's discharged of course this battery is not new from time to time i can see something a little bit of green so to measure the voltage of the battery you can use the charger itself just plug it in first then connect the negative there and the positive there and it's showing 12.8 volts so just by connecting it to the power and connecting the minus and the plus to the battery it is showing the voltage of the battery it's not charging so this is a voltmeter in this mode battery is currently at 12.8 volts since the line is not flashing it's not charging 